It's a great question. In many ways, uh, people have said that semiconductor are the new oil of the modern era. Uh, semiconductors um, basically power everything from heart monitors to microwaves to your car to basically anything that requires electricity, an on and off switch, has semiconductors. They basically dominate everything that's going on um, from the phone that we're recording on, uh, from the lights that, are, uh, that, that turn off and on here. Semiconductors are part of our everyday life. Taiwan's role in the global semiconductor supply chain is critical because if you look at the giant U.S. tech giants, you know, the Googles, the Amazons, um, they design chips, but they don't actually manufacture chips. All of the major tech giants manufacture their chips in Taiwan through TSMC. If you also look at the U.S. defense industrial base, uh, where they make their fighter jets, their radars, their satellites, all of those are processed and manufactured in TSMC, which is a Taiwanese semiconductor manufacturing plant. So without Taiwan's semiconductor plants, uh, we basically lose one-fifth of global chips production and up to 90% of the most advanced cutting-edge chips. So semiconductors have long been a cornerstone of U.S.-Taiwan relations. Uh, and in many ways, uh, when Morris Chang first founded TSMC back in the 1980s, one of the key driving principles was to create a greater relationship with the United States. And since then, Taiwan, specifically TSMC, has created its, uh, an indispensable role in the global semiconductor supply chain and through which many U.S. companies, U.S. firms, uh, defense uh, contractors will continue to rely on Taiwan uh, for their future to come. It's a careful balance that they have to navigate because uh, U.S. firms are uh, their number one client. China comes in a close second. And then when U.S. enacted export restrictions forbidding the sale of the most advanced semiconductor technology to uh, China, that severely limited Taiwan's ability uh, to make uh, advantages in its own market. And so Taiwan is doing a careful job of being sure both to strengthen the relationship with the United States, but not to handicap the relationship with China.